In this screencast, I'm going to show you how to embed a PDF in your Google site page so that it displays right on a page so you can view it right in there. And it will look in the end just like this. We're going to do it in a way so that the PDF is stored not in your McAllister Google Drive account, but in your regular Gmail Google Drive account. When you graduate, your McAllister Google Apps account is going to go away and that means that any links you create to documents in that account in that Google Drive account are going to go away as well and so you don't want all of a sudden to have uh, resources disappearing in your Google site. Let's start at the top. I'm going to uh, create a new page. I'm not going to worry about where it's going to be located right now. So we're just going to set it up first with the insert and then more gadgets and the one that we're going to use didn't even have to search for it it's called the include gadget which has iframe and iframe is our friend so we're going to click on that then select and now we are in a place where we're prepared to enter information about our our pdf so i'm going to go uh, flip over to safari and I already have Google Drive for my regular Gmail account open and I'm going to go over to the document that I want to embed click the checkbox next to it more share share and I want to show you how you want to have the settings uh, set up it is set up so that anyone who has the link can view it and that's what you want there be private can be public on the web this one has it set up so that you have to at least have the link to view it. And I want to have it so that people can just view it and I'm just not going to want commenting or editing. Save and you're set. Next thing, copy this link to your clipboard and you're done. Go back to your gadget here. You want to paste that URL and then set up the page dimensions. In other words, how large or how it's going to display uh, on your page. For PDFs especially, I like to set it up so that it's going to go across 100% of the page. That means I need to set this value here to 100 and then change it from pixels to percent. And then in terms of height, I'm gonna have it be uh, 800 pixels. PDFs are fairly large documents and I want to have it pretty big. And then here you can have the name of the document. So I'm just going to say UDL guidelines. And I'm set. If I want to preview it, I can preview it by clicking here. But instead, I'm just going to click OK for right now. And you won't see exactly how it's going to look until you click and save the document. So I'll do that. There you go. So you can see you have the uh, Google PDF viewer uh, set up here and it even gives you the thumbnail view. To get rid of the thumbnail view, click that and then you have it so that it takes up the whole page. So that is how you embed a PDF directly so it's viewable into a Google site page.